hi students if you like this video please subscribe and share it don't forget to like it now i am going on topic is mathematical reasoning now this chapter is very important for je mains and also very easiest topic converse inverse contra positive let p comma q be two statements first year statement p implies q converse statement q implies p now inverse statement negation p implies negation q now contra positive negation q implies negation p example let p is equal to x is an even integer now q is equal to x square is divisible by 4 okay now your first statement p implies q if x is an even integer then x square is divisible by 4 okay next converse statement q implies p x square is divisible by 4 then x is an even now inverse statement negation p implies negation q if x is not even integer then x square is not divisible by 4 next contra positive negation q implies negation p if x square is not divisible by 4 then x is not an even integer now question the contra positive of this statement if you are born in india then you are a citizen of india is okay now here four options are given now first year given statement divided into two statements if you are born in india then you are a citizen of india okay now here first year write down let p be the one of the statement p is equal to you are born in india you are born in india let q is equal to you are a citizen of india you are a citizen of india you are a citizen of india okay now your statement p implies q is the statement then the contra positive of this statement is negation q implies negation p okay not q implies not p this is the contra positive okay now your contra positive of this statement contra positive negation q implies negation p okay now if you are not a citizen of india if you are not a citizen of india if you are not a citizen of india then you are not a then you are not born in india then then you are you are not born in india okay now contra positive of this statement if you are not a citizen of india then you are not born in india now your option a is the correct one option a is the correct one now your question the contra positive of this statement if two numbers are not equal then their squares are not equal okay now your four options are given if the squares of two numbers are not equal then the numbers are not equal. the squares of two numbers are equal then the numbers are equal 
If the squares of two numbers are not equal, then the numbers are equal. Now, if the squares of two numbers are equal, then the numbers are not equal. Okay. Now, your first year given statement convert into two statements. Now, your p let p is equal to. Now, two numbers are not equal. Two numbers are. Two numbers are. Not equal. Okay, let Q is equal to. Now squares are not equal. Squares are not equal. Okay, now P implies Q. It is a statement. Now we are contra positive of the given statement. Negation Q implies. Negation P. Not Q implies not P. Is the contra positive. Now contra positive. Negation Q implies negation P. Okay. Now if the squares of two numbers. If the squares of. If the squares of two numbers are equal, if the squares of two numbers are equal, then then the numbers are equal. Then the numbers are equal. Okay. If the squares of two numbers are equal, then the numbers are equal. Now, option B is the correct one. Option B is the correct one. Next question: The contra positive of this statement is, if the side of a square of doubled, then its area increases four times. Okay. Now here four options are given. First year given statement convert into two statements. Let P is equal to. Now here P is equal to the sides of a square doubled. The side of a square. The side of a square half doubled. The side of a square doubled. Next, another statement: area increases four times. Area increases four times. Now, area increases four times. Okay. Now, P implies Q is the statement. Then, the contra positive of this statement is negation Q implies. Negation P. Now contra positive is equal to contra positive. Negation Q implies negation P. Okay. Now if the area of square, if the area of area of a square. Does not increase. If area of a square does not increase, does not increase four times. Does not increase four times. Then its side is not doubled. Then its Side is not doubled. Okay. If the area of a square does not increase four times, then its side is not doubled. Now here, option D is the correct one. Option D is the correct one. Next one is the contra positive of this statement. If it is raining, 
then I will not count. Okay, now here also four options are given. Now your first given statement convert into two statements. Let P. It is raining. It is raining. Q is equal to I will not come. I will not come. Okay, now your statement P implies Q. Then the contra positive of the given statement negation Q implies negation P. Now contra positive. Now negation Q implies negation P. Okay, negation Q. Here I will not come. If I will come, if I will come, it is not raining. It is not raining. Okay. If I will come, if it is not raining. Okay. Now here, option 1 is the correct one. If I will come, if is not raining. Okay, option 1 is the correct one. 